Hello students, welcome to this amazing video. Today I'm going to show you how to basically trace a logo. So how to use some of the tools in Autodesk to, I'm going to trace that guy right there because I love baseball. How to use some of the different tools in Autodesk to make something, I mean you can pick whatever you would like, but basically you're using line tools, and you're using the extrusion tools, and hopefully learning a bunch in order to make something that's important to you. So that's what my finished product looks like. You can see that it's 3D. I've extruded it, put it on like a nice base. From the front, it looks just like a logo, just like a flat 2D object. But if we look at it from an angle, we can see that it is indeed a 3D object with extrusions and depth and different colors and all kinds of good stuff. So from the beginning, you find an image that you want, you drag it to the desktop. So if you just Google something and drag it from Google onto the desktop, you should be fine. And then you're going to open up Autodesk and you are going to start a new part. Say start 2D sketch. I like to click on my XY plane, especially for something that's standing up. And then you got all these tools over here. You're probably familiar with a lot of those. We're going to come down to this end and we're going to select image. It's then going to access your files. I want to access the files that are on my desktop because that is where I drug my picture. Drug it right onto my desktop. I'm going to scroll down a little bit because I got a few few things on my desktop. I'm going to find the image and I'm going to open it up it is ready to place it wherever I want it to go. If I zoom out I can see that it's a pretty big image. I could try to put it you know with that yellow dot right in the middle. I'm, I'm going to put it down here in this quadrant. So I'm just going to connect the corner of it to my uh, my origin right there. I left click one time and I've placed it, it will continue to place it. If for some reason you wanted to place the image all over the all over the screen, you could. I just want to place one of them. So I will right click and I will say OK. Remember right click offers you all kinds of shortcuts and fast travel menus. So I'll right click and I will say OK. And then I'm going to finish sketch. Click on my, on my little house right there and it takes me back so I can get it in view. And there is my flat. If I look at it from the right side, can't see anything because it's a flat 2D image. I spin around and look at it from the front. Looks pretty good. So we will stop that video here. Hopefully you can find a logo or an image, something you want to trace, something you want to outline and turn into a 3D object uh, and hopefully you can get it uploaded into Autodesk Inventor and in the next video I'll show you how to start using all those drawing tools, all those 2D sketch mode tools in order to trace it and extrude it.